Salam, hello everyone. I wanted to come on here to talk to you guys about a couple of books that I think you might be interested in, especially those of you who ask me for recommendations as it relates to Afghanistan history and culture. The author is somebody I've known for many years and we had the privilege of working on an art show many years ago and I did a painting of Leo or um, Rose and Jack from Titanic because I was obsessed with that movie uh, and also I did a painting or drawing of Princess Diana and he gave me feedback on that at that exhibit I will never forget and coincidentally we were both interviewed for a segment National Geographic TV did after 9-11 about Afghan Americans his name is Mr. Ahmed Nawid and the books are Art Through the Ages in Afghanistan Volume 1 and Volume 2 Volume 1 takes you through prehistoric times through the Islamic era. As you can see, I've made a lot of notes in it, a lot of pictures. It goes through the order of time in history. And Volume 2 is um, early Islamic era to present time. And there's a lot of nice images, a lot of information. And in the back, he does list his sources, um, which I know is important. A lot of them I've marked because I have purchased the books or plan to. So you can pick up these books. I got mine from Amazon. Amazing, amazing two volume. Now he himself is, um, he is a professor, a scholar, and also a very talented fine artist. Some of his paintings blow me away. They're, they're just so good and you guys all need to know about him. So it made me very happy that he sent me this message under one of my posts. Let me read it to you. This was under my recent video about the Ghorid Empire. Thank you, Samira John. You are doing a great job. Please contact me. I can help you with more information on the Ghorid architecture. I am very happy that you are doing valuable service for preservation of Afghanistan's glorious culture and history. And that's my response to him. Pause to read. So it makes me very happy to have the validation and appreciation from a scholar and a professor and an artist um, who specializes in Afghanistan's history and culture as it relates to art and architecture, which is something I'm also interested in. I'm also interested in textiles, which is what got me into this series. And I hope to collaborate with him. So thank you, Araya Nawid, for your kind messages. It really means a lot to me. And I hope that more Afghans and more people learn about you and your work. I also want to share with you this vest that I've upcycled. It's vintage, it's suede, and it has this cute little fringe on the back. Look what I did. I added some Afghan beadwork. What 